Hi, I'm Doug McKinley, and you're watching Adorama TV. Today we're going to be looking at color. Not just the incidental color that's in every picture, but we want to get to the roots of color and how it can shape an image. Adorama TV presents Stay Focused with Doug McKinley. Like many markets, everything's on display. But it's up to us as photographers to find those great pictures. And this place is fantastic. There is just so much to shoot here. But since today our subject is color, let's go find some great street art. For instance, here's a piece of graffiti that's exhibiting some great bold colors. Lots of blues, lots of reds, primary colors. It's gonna be very striking. It'll make a fantastic picture. It'll stand out. Now that's almost it. But I think what I should do is get a little tighter, a little closer. Maybe just pick up the piece of the eye and a little bit of the color on the outside here. Make it really, really, really tight, really, really close. Make it really stand out. It's not all about bold colors. We want to see some nice, quiet colors as well. With this image, for instance, we've got some yellows, some reds, some browns, some greens. Great colors for the autumn. Nice and subtle, evokes a different kind of emotion than the bold colors. Nice and quiet. Yeah, that works really well. I don't think we need to do anything more to this picture. I love this place. It's fantastic. Every week it changes. You never know what you're going to get. It's a great place for pictures. But before we even think about taking pictures, we got to think about white balance. White balance is the way to control your images in terms of color casts. And the best way to do that is to shoot in RAW files. That way it can be changed at any time in the computer. Unfortunately, the JPEG files, what happens is the camera will choose the white balance. And oftentimes that leaves you with a really nasty color cast that you cannot fix. So shoot in RAW, always shoot in RAW. One aspect of color we haven't touched on yet are complementary colors. This is when the shades of colors are very similar, like a blue sky against a blue sea. As you can see behind me, the graffiti, the colors are quite similar. It helps to evoke a sense of calm and serenity. Very nice images. Don't forget to check out Adorama's latest contest where you could win some amazing prizes. So we've just checked out some fantastic graffiti art. Now let's get deep into the market. Let's go for a stroll. Today we've been looking at different aspects of color. Not just the incidental color that happens in every picture, but color is a subject in itself. And I'm confident if you take the time to plan your images around the color, photography will only improve. That's it for today. I'm Doug McKinley for Adorama TV. Do you want great looking prints at low cost? Be sure to visit our easy to use online printing service. Adorama Pix has professionals who treat your images with the utmost care that you can count on. For a quick turnaround on photos, cards, or albums, use adoramapix.com.